Dear brothers and sisters in Christ Jesus, today, the 9th of December, Holy Mother, the Church calls us to the memory of St. Peter Furia. He lived between 1565 to 1640. Born on 30th November 1565 at Lorraine in France, Peter Fourier was educated at the Jesuit University and later he became a canon regular at St. Augustine in 1585 and was ordained priest in 1589 and obtained doctorate in patristic theology in 1595, graduating brilliantly. For the field of his priestly labors, he chose the area of Martin Court. It was the poorest area, most corrupt and threatened by Calvinism. Within a few years, with his saintly example of personal mortification, austerity, loving instruction and fervent prayer, he had brought a complete spiritual reformation into that place. He organized the Guild of St. Sebastian for Men, Rosary Society for Women and Immaculate Conception Society for Young Girls. For the spiritual instruction of the children, the good father of Martin Court composed a series of dialogues on Christian virtues to be publicly recited by children on Sundays. The poor of the parish being ever his special concern, uh, Peter founded a mutual help bank and a voluntary court of abbreviation for the friendly and just settlement of all disputes. In 1597, with the cooperation of Blessed Alex de Lac, he laid the foundation for the Religious Society of Women and that really grew in large numbers so that at the outbreak of the French Revolution, there were already 4,000 women in this congregation. In 1621, at the request of Bishop Toll, Peter undertook the reform of Augustinian Canons Regular, which eventually resulted in establishment of Canons Regular of Lorraine as a congregation of our Savior in 1629 he was elected the superior general of which in 1632 peter for year remarkable zeal and success in converting calvinists can be seen especially in the principality of psalm which was really filled with protestants uh, in the space of six months he brought all the poor strangers as he called the protestants into the fold of the church he died in the year 1640 on 9th december and was beatified in 1730 and canon by Pope Leo Tathint in 1897. This is the story of Peter Furia, a founder of the congregation, a person who lived his life completely for God and especially in the face of Calvinism, in the face of uh, uh, opposition, he lived a life dedicated for God. So we pray that we too, like him, may live a life for God. Amen.